everyone. Thank you so much for coming to this wonderful and very unique concert tonight. Um, this is going to be a wonderfully one-of-a-kind experience um, here. We have a wonderful uh, guest artist alongside one of our professors here. Um, Yerji Pazor is a professor from the Prague Conservatory who has toured the world not only with Professor Ann Rose, but um, as an improvisational um, teacher as well as an improviser himself on piano and also being a comp composer as well. Um, our professor Ann Rose teaches free improvisation here and is a wonderful teacher in our community. Um, both of these wonderful people are here to perform to you tonight um, some free improvisational ideas that might just come from their brain and their wonderful thoughts, but also will be inspired by many various ideas such as folk tunes from both the Czech and also from here. Um, so feel free to um, listen and enjoy and really be inspired by the wonderful things that they will do here for you tonight. Just a few side notes. There will be a brief intermission um, in which they will exit the stage and then afterwards feel free to stay and they will be improvising the themes that you wrote down for them tonight. In addition, um, in case of an emergency, the exits are up to your left and right as well as straight in the back and no flash photography or any video recordings. When there's a musical pause or some silence, please feel free to clap and tell these people that they are doing some wonderful music. Without further ado, I'd like to introduce Professor Ann Rose and Yerji Pazor. everyone thank you for coming to this very special and unique concert like Molly mentioned uh, we are so privileged and lucky to have uh, uh, Professor Pajour coming here and um, playing music with us we would like to thank you first of all with uh, for SUNY Fredonia and also uh, a student association a music um, improv collective to sponsoring us to make this happen um, Anyhow, uh, uh, without further ado, our first song we will be improvising um, is um, based on um, two different countries, Czech and U.S. Uh, we um, picked a wonderful um, uh, American uh, com composition by Aaron Copland, Simple uh, Gift, um, and also uh, Smetna. Uh, Moldau from Czech Republic, and then that's I we, that would be just perfect way to start the concert and renew uh, unite this wonderful world together. <laughs> so enjoy.
gentlemen, good evening. Thank you for your applause and kind welcome. I was looking forward to this concert and I am very glad that, uh, oh, okay. <laughs> that uh, we, met, we meet here today. I believe in this hall we will experience a pleasant time together. I would especially like to thank the University of Fredonia and the Improv Collective for the invitation. I am very happy that my trip was organized and that we can all meet here now. I am very happy that here in this hall Anne and I can meet again so that we can improvise for you and create music together. I and Anne met in this hall already in 2017 when we recorded here our CD Bridge Across the Ocean. Now I would like to play you an improvisation on the theme of Czech folk song Ach Sinku Sinku, it is in English translation Oh My Dear Son. I recorded this improvisation some time ago on my solo CD titled Czech, Moravian and Slovak Folk Songs in Piano Transformations. It's my very favorite song and I am happy to improvise on the theme of this song now for you.
beautiful, beautiful folk tune, folk tune from Czech Republic. I would like you to uh, now travel a little bit more east to South Korea. Um, next song that I would like to improvise is uh, uh, improvisation based on Korean folk tune called Dora Ji. Um, Dora Ji, uh, translated in Korean, means Korean bellflower. And this is a, a wonderful, not only beautiful, but actually you can eat this, actually. Um, Korean people, they will take the root of the Dora Ji bellflower. They can probably put, they can put it in a salad or a teas, and it's very healthy for you. I wouldn't say it's very delicious, but it's very healthy for you. Um, so uh, there are so many wonderful things about this Doraji uh, bellflower song brings back is um, uh, some of you guys uh, may know that that um, in addition for me teaching in SUNY Fredonia, uh, I'm actually full-time elementary school music teacher in uh, St. Clairville Elementary School in Casa de Gavali district branch and uh, I have a, just a wonderful time uh, creating music with uh, these little ones and last year they really wanted to sing something special so I introduced this Korean song and uh, they wanted to learn not just in English but Korean as well so I <laughs> had to teach them how to pronounce and everything and boy they were really amazing um, so uh, speaking of I mean when I was working with uh, little children uh, that did bring back uh, memories of South Korea for me I was born in South Korea and um, uh, boy, uh, I was there when I was a child, uh, but I left 32 years ago. I would like to be forever 28. I, <laughs> unfortunately, the math doesn't do it. But um, so when I worked with them, it did bring me back home when I was a little uh, child. And now, it, it, what a wonderful memories. You know, you're innocent and you're pure too, but then you look at yourself, you know, you're not young anymore. It's 32 years after. Um, and some, sometimes I talk about this, my family, like if I ever go back to Korea for travel or something like that. 32 years after, with this country the same as I remembered in my memory, am I the same person as 32 years ago as I remembered? Because just like me and just like you, many years has passed. There's a past and present and future we go through a lot of things. They're not all innocent and pure or happy or, you know, there's also hardships and <laughs> many things. I mean, I, I get birth to two children. That's already another thing. <laughs> so my life has changed. Um, and and yeah, what I'm trying to say is as I play this song, um, I think a little bit of my childhood will come out too, but a little bit of my lifespan, hoping um, yearning back to my childhood when I was that young. <laughs> but I don't know where the song's gonna go, I have no idea. <laughs> but here we go, Toraji the Bellflower.
I attended the music improvisation festival in Canada in 2016 and when I heard Anne improvise there for the first time I was really excited. I felt that her musical sensibility is so similar to mine. I approached her and asked if we could try improvise together on two pianos. We started playing the free improvisation and it was a wonderful experience for me. I am very happy that this first meeting of ours resulted in further cooperation. First, we recorded our piano duo improvisational CD Bridge Across the Ocean and then a number of our piano duo concerts in the Czech Republic followed. Now 
we meet here in this hall in Fredonia and so the idea of musical bridge across the ocean has really come to fruition. So Yurji and I had a nice long talk about this and he told me to add this part. Not only our meeting was very special, but as we get to know each other as a, a friends and as a musician, our music has uh, changed in a most wonderful way because of our trusting each other and uh, we know each other's family and what a wonderful family he has as well. But it's so amazing how the getting to know and uh, trusting each other in a personal level makes the music going at a different level. And so we would like to improvise you about that, <laughs> I guess, about how we started, where we are going and how excited about this about, but we're gonna have to kind of uh, figure out how to do this, but it's gonna be, <laughs> yes, all right.
next uh, next improvisation I will be improvising will be theme of uh, beloved uh, classical composition um, uh, Sibelius's um, Finlandia and uh, what a beautiful beautiful classical music um, not only is this is such a, a meaningful uh, beautiful classical music but I also uh, love it as a, a hymn. Some of you guys might know this as a, a hymn as um, Be Still My Soul. They have the same tune. So um, I had a speech in my head and I'm kind of blank here because I think I'm, I think I'm nervous. <laughs> I can hear <laughs> kind of stuttering. I'll do my very best. Um, Many of us, I think all of us, since the pandemic, maybe even before that, we went through a lot of hardships. And especially globally, going through a pandemic was a very difficult one. And for somehow we pull ourselves together and after many years we are here having a concert. And this is a, such a wonderful, wonderful thing that we can do this. And. Um, if I just go back and think about this, even though we want the peace in the world, it's not like that. Even though we want to have the best things just you know, happening for us, as you know, that's not the life is like. Sometimes we have a joy, but sometimes we have stress and um, so many uh, just things that's not so fortunate is happening around the world. And when I teach the little ones in my school, it's sometimes it's very easy to see that. And as a teacher, my job is to make sure that they're safe and they're in a place that they can learn. Uh, but we had to reset them. And one of the things I tell them to is take a breath through your nose and breathe out through your mouth. And then, and then we did a few times, and most often they're calm and they're reset and they're ready to go. And if there's something to learn about that as an adult. We are, we are so busy with our lives, taking care of other people. We have a works and stuff like that. Sometimes we kind of possibly forget how to reset. So I'm not a shrink or a psychologist, but one of the things I can suggest for you is if you can just breathe in through your nose and out through your mouth and try to be still. And when you are in that calm place, that's when we can start re-guide ourselves and focus, help us to heal and help others because we have to be healthy to help others. We have to be healthy to help ourselves, you know? So I think this is a very important that we remember that and I, I actually teach students sometimes they don't know how to be still and that's a difficult thing so that's one of the things we we taught um, and then it's helping them so my be still my soul is not going to be like that it will be <laughs> like this um, because we know there's a lot of emotions going on but how do we set it back and I think I'm hoping that this will also uh, <laughs> that you can relate it to this too, because um, I live through this every day. <laughs> Anyhow, this is a Be Still My Soul, Finlandia Spelius.
Now I would like to play you an improvisation called Vivat Gershwin. <laughs> I like Gershwin's music very much. I often play um, improvisation, uh, improvisations um, uh, to Gershwin's themes uh, on my concerts. And today I will play you an impression uh, where I will use several melodies from Gershwin's two compositions, Rhapsody in Blue and an American in Paris.
composer Jaroslav Ježek composed classical music, stage music, and he wrote a lot of songs for theater plays. Ježek cooperated with the playwrights, comedians Jan Verich and Jiří Boskovec, leaders of the Prague Liberated Theater. His songs was very often influenced by jazz. N and I would like to play you an improvisation on a song by Jaroslav Ježek called David and Goliath. Hi, so we got some wonderful things here, and uh, I have borrowed this hat from my son, and he's letting me using it. And what I will do is, uh, Yurja and I talked about this, he's going to pick. <laughs> and I'm going to ask who wrote this, so we know it's really genuine. <laughs> right? And then we'll have to figure out what we're going to do, but are you ready? <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> you just wrong rules. Romance of the Railroads. Who wrote that? Ooh, okay. <laughs> so let's do
No. Oh! <laughs> now, B natural us. H, so it's a Bach. B A C H.
Ladies and gentlemen, because concert will slowly end, let me thank you. Thank you for coming. Thank you for the atmosphere you created today in this hall. I wish you all the best, and I look forward to seeing you again in the future. I wish you a nice rest of the evening.
Thank you again for coming today. Uh, we will like end with um, another beloved theme, American theme, um, Over the Rainbow. And uh, you don't really need an explanation for that, but we would like to send you off where the clouds are far behind us and traveling to smell like lemon drops. And you know what I mean. <laughs> so here we go. And uh, thank you so much again for coming. And thank you to SUNY Virginia and Improv Collective to make this happen for us. Thank you. Thank you.